This might sting, but working out just when it feels good or when you're comfortable is not going to stimulate your muscles in a way that elicits true muscle stimuli. And this is important because if you have a slow metabolism, impaired hormones, imbalances, you likely are not building enough muscle to fight insulin resistance. Hi, my name is Ashley. I've lost over 100 pounds naturally, reverse prediabetes, and managing my PCOS. And it's not by chasing fleeting moments of feeling good. It's by building muscle on purpose. Think about it. If you only exercise when you feel good, that's like saying you'll eat vegetables when it feels good. Sure, you'll get some benefit here and there, but it's not consistent. You're not going to see full transformation. And you want to work on insulin resistance. You want to heal your metabolism and balance your hormones. Girlfriend, you need strategy. And I say this as a friend, right? Lifting weights focusing on progressive overload and hitting those bigger muscle groups, that is how you're going to support your insulin resistance by up to 45%. And I'm not saying go sign up at a CrossFit gym. Okay, you can work out at home by lifting weights. The intent is muscle growth, stimulation, keep your blood sugar stable, balance your hormones, and that way your body's working with you even after the workout is done because your muscles are doing the work for